Raul Esparza. Hello, my name is Raul Esparza. Well, they all know who you are, but uh, you may not know uh, what a, well, you probably know what a, a major uh, uh, performance he gave in Sunday in the Park with George. As usual. Uh, Sunday in the Park with George uh, tells the story for, does anyone not know? He plays the great painter George Surratt, the pointillist painter, and I am his muse. And uh, uh, it asks the question, which we can all ask of ourselves, uh, can you have an artistic life, which you can probably use as a metaphor for any other kind of vocation, can you be obsessed though with what you want to accomplish in life, and can you have Domesticity? Can you have a personal life? Is there room for both love and that kind of drive? And they uh, are divided by that, and he chooses the painting, essentially, though I think he loved her. She had a baby, she chose another man. In the second act, there's a modern sequence where there's another George who is, is uh, two generations later, and that young man is a blocked artist. And that young man is, is, is struggling, cannot find the answers. And if you can believe it, we're in an artistic world where the painting itself, George Surratt's painting, is present on the stage. And uh, this beautiful uh, uh, character who was Dot in the first act, in her gown and her hat and parasol, emerges from the painting to talk to the George of two uh, generations later. Essentially, the two Georges merge as one, and these two uh, essences sing this uh, time-liberated uh, uh, song. This is uh, where Sondheim is a fascinating man. He loved to play with time. So you are now entering the time no zone. No, no, you're just entering my Sondheim brain, his Sondheim brain. <laughs> Enter I, Sondheim's brain. I'm going to add to this story because the two things that Steve said that the show is about. Uh, Steve. Steve said that um, that the show is about a creative artist. Uh, that means someone who makes something that was never there before. So whether it's a work of art or a child, hence uh, uh, both things go on beyond you. And she has a child and it goes on beyond and the child and the work of art meet. But the other thing I remember about doing this song is you singing it with him standing in the wings. And you were lit and you had like a key light on your eyes and the orchestra was playing and I thought, oh my God, I will never forget this for the rest of my life yeah. in rehearsals. And I also remember that he would clear out the orchestra section to give notes, and he would write notes at the bottom of a legal pad. So you knew that the only person in the orchestra section was Stephen Sondheim, and with his legal pad. And he would write a note at the bottom, and then he would go, Rip! and put it aside. And so the entire cast, as the show would go on, you would hear, Rip! Rip! and by the time we got to the song Sunday, the whole cast was doing this. <laughs> I actually have one of those notes framed. <laughs> it says, tell Raul he's fantastic today if you think it's a good idea. <laughs> I'm not making that up. Yeah. You know, he said once to me, he said, you are wonderful most of the time. <laughs> should take this on the road. Are you working on here. something new? You're yeah, supposed to I'm, ask used, me. I'm used to doing this without you. Yeah, yeah, interesting. I've had to survive without you. Let's go on the road. So, are you working on something new? No, I am not working on anything new. That is not like you, George. I have nothing to say. You have many things. I have nothing to say. You have many things. Well, nothing that's not been said. Said by you, though, George. I do not know where to go. Die. I want to make things that count. Things that I did new. what I had to do. What am I to do? Every 
you understand the light. Understand the light. Concentrate I want on to now. draw. I want to explore the light. I want to know how to break through through to something new. Something of my own. more to see. 